Okay, uh, the video today is The Millionaire. Um, it's been a little while since we've done one of these just because, you know, the world has been on fire, so it didn't seem appropriate to uh, to make the drink videos. Uh, well, it was uh, awful everywhere. So we're coming back strong with The Millionaire. This is a uh, drink that I have never tried before. Uh, I looked up the recipe and um, it looks fantastic. Um, and it is guaranteed to get a reaction out of somebody. Um, so, the first component is uh, some whiskey. Uh, you can do bourbon, you can do whiskey. Um, th this is a, a drink that actually came out of uh, Prohibition. So the, the recipes are all kind of different. Everybody has a slightly different recipe. Um, some of the old recipes, uh, it, it's pretty much just whiskey, uh, curacao, grenadine, um, and the other component. Um, but people have added in like uh, absinthe ever since, um, lemon, um, they've added in uh, nutmeg, all sorts of stuff. My daughter is stealing a lemon and <laughs> licking it. It's gross. Um, so we'll, we'll go ahead and start off by throwing together all of the, uh, the components. So here you go. Uh, number one is whiskey, bourbon, or however you want to do it, uh, whatever your flavor. So two ounces of the old whiskey. Uh, then you need your curacao. Which again, I've been informed it is not curacao, it's curacao. Um, and with that, you do about three quarters of an ounce. So you're gonna have to eyeball a little bit. Yeah, about three quarters. Then you do about a half an ounce of lemon. I squeezed a lemon, the one that has been licked on already. Um, I, I squeezed- Get your hands off my lemon. <laughs> I squeezed that into here. So um, just about a half ounce of lemon and then you need about half an ounce of grenadine. Grenadine is mostly just for the color. Uh, it's going to have a really cool red color uh, when you when you see it and I think that's part of the why they call it the millionaire because it looks fancy like a millionaire would have. You put that in there and then the component. The added extra component. <laughs> Which is, I was going for that reaction for my daughter, uh, the look of horror. Uh, egg white. You're going for a raw egg white uh, that you're going to put in there. So, you're going to do crack your egg. And then... I don't know. What? Yeah. My wife is asking questions from downstairs. Yes, you're supposed to froth it up inside the... Uh, uh, in your, your shaker here. So the egg white, once you separate it, you okay? You gonna barf? <laughs> you look like you're gonna barf. Um, all right, so then you just drop the egg white in there. Don't add your ice yet. You wanna froth it by putting it in here and shaking it a little bit. Get it nice and frothy. With all the other components. Oh, frothy. It's getting there. It's getting frothy. It's frothy. Yeah. It's getting frothy. What? You want to shake it? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. There. Too, too frothy. All right. Now you can add in your uh, your ice. I also pre-chilled the glass, so it'll also be nice and cold. Now you do some more shaking. And pour your now frothy drink into a fancy glass. Looks like medicine. It would taste like medicine if I added in the absinthe. It's it calls for, some recipes call for a half of an ounce of absinthe to go in there. Absinthe does taste like uh, medicine to me. Uh, no, I'm not, I don't want it. It looks like that weird Pepto Bismol. <laughs> it's, it's a little Pepto Bismol y. And you add a little nutmeg on top for fun. Done. That's it. That is the millionaire. Ew. How does it taste? Good. Ooh, that tastes really good. Ooh, that's a good drink. <laughs> 